Hey everybody, the Bond is back. Welcome to part 24 of Let's Play Mother 3, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. I don't think we want to go that way. We can go over here to the shower if we want to, just to like recover more health, just in case, you know, we decided to go back down to do some more training. But I don't think the slugs would be worth much. Let's go up to the attic. Oh, there's a mouse. Squeak, squeak! I so greedy and love to collect things. Would you like to buy some of mine? If I got any. But I guess Lola can hold on to that. Ooh, a better stick would be very good. Uh, I can buy some pencil rockets if I had enough money. Okay, I definitely wanted to invest in the better stick. How much uh, money do I have saved up? Let's find out. Oh, I don't have enough. So I'm not even going to bother to, like, uh, withdraw anything, because I know I'm not going to be able to afford it anyway. Okay, we can go that left or we can go right. Oh, there's the attic guide. Alright, now we know where to go. Hi there, I'm the friendly item deposit guy, blah blah blah. Okay, what do we want to get rid of? I'd say we don't need that many antidotes. And I could probably get rid of this pamphlet for now. I just gotta remember to pick it up again later, because I have a feeling it's gonna be useful for something. Um... I don't think the trivia card is all that useful, so I'm probably just gonna deposit it. Like, I'm only gonna deposit it because what if it actually is useful, then I can come back and get it. Um... I think we'll keep the paper fan, it might be useful. So I think we're good for now. Yeah, I get it. You're motivational. You don't have to rub it in my face. Oh, I think we just killed that enemy. Would have if we like did it again. And a rock nid. Notice there's a lot more exclamation points. And because our stats are pretty good, we were able to dominate it. Okay, we should probably should not run into any enemies. I was trying to get a back attack. You encountered a greedier mouse. As if a greedy one wasn't was bad enough. And we got some peculiar cheese. Nice. And we got some bug spray. All right, we're around here. Oh, that was a new enemy. It almost looked like a magic butterfly, but it turns out it was an elder baddie. Right, get rid of one of those enemies, then we can deal with the bat. We're gonna bat that baddie out of there. Whoa, okay. Apparently it survived that. Now it's dead. Was that blood worth it? Still the blood of a dog. Bastard. Okay, there's two different pathways. Well, I, I guess like a brown and blue doors don't even matter. They practically have the same purpose. I uh, would have liked to go that way just to get the tr to get the item box. So let's do that. Oh, it's just an antidote. All right. There's a guitar over here. But it's just standing there by itself, so there's definitely something going on with it. I think we'll go after the spider first, because it's weaker. Oh, tried to steal an item from me. Said some nasty, horrible things. Haha. <laughs> it's like, I run away from your words. Because that's how it works. Mm. Coffee's still a little bit hot, that's good. A magic tart. Okay, that definitely looks like a boss, because look at it. it it's got them eyes of anger. 
looks like we can't get through from that way. Looks like we'll have to go around this direction. Hey, what's up? Apparently mice have bags of big city fries as well. I found that very weird. Um, hi. A gently weeping guitar. Um, was it a good idea to fight this thing? Because there was only one by itself. Okay. Okay, well it wasn't that strong. It was strong-ish. Alright, so, I don't know if we have enough. But we can probably, like, uh, go back to that frog. Not only just to recover our HP at the sauna, but also to, well, make sure we can actually buy that, uh, stick. I say that stick would be awesome for us. Ooh, level 26! So HP goes up by 2, PP by 3, Offense 2, Speed 1, no, Defense 1, IQ 2, okay, Speed does go up by 1, so I wasn't really wrong. I just read the wrong stat. Sometimes I'm an idiot. Oh, why am I going that way? Did we fight enough enemies to get a total of 500 DP? Yep, we did. Okay, we're perfect. We're perfect in every way. Oh, uh, yeps. Rest in that sauna with your cap on. Not that it's gonna get all muggy or anything. <laughs> Wish I could see, like, every single stat. Oh, my inventory is full. Okay. I know what I need to do. I'm gonna start transferring some of my goods. Easy grip stick. Did I, ha did I have another weapon attached to it? No, I didn't. I was thinking of something else for some reason. Lola's inventory is not that full. That's good. I'll keep the flea powder on myself because, well, obviously, what if Lola gets fleas and she can't do anything? We get be better off giving that to her. All right. So the better stick. Well, its offense goes up by twenty. Oh yeah, that's much better. And we got some DP back. 1 way again, like an idiot. Alright, so we're back to full health, and I got a new weapon. So things are gonna be coming up Millhouse. Well, unless that happens. Okay, so I guess we gotta deal with the baddie first. Okay, the offense is a little bit better. Okay, the uh, arachnid can poison us. As far as I know, the worst thing the baddie can do is, well, drain our HP. Still bad, though, but not terrible compared to the potential being poisoned. Oh, there's a drum set! The beaten drum. Oh, it's gonna get beaten, alright. In many ways. See? What did I tell ya? <laughs> okay, looks like we gotta get past that enemy to get the, uh, item. I feel bad for this, uh, guitar because the strings are snapped. There. That mitigated some of the damage we took. And Nola's now at level 26. So her HP goes up by 3, Offense by 1, IQ by 2. Wow. Not a lot of stat gain in share. Okay, we got a Sprinting Bomb. Alright. I'm gonna let Lola hold the offensive weapons because Bonga right now is an offensive weapon. 
So it probably doesn't need it that much. Oh, that's also a dead end. Okay, looks like I gotta go left down and then I can probably make it to the right. Alright, let's go. Okay, I was not hoping for that. Hey, you stole my bread roll. Why you do this? Oh, you're gonna get it now. You all gonna get it now. I better get my bread roll back if I defeat these guys. It's just us now. Uh, now it's just us. Without you. I did not get my bread roll back, did I? Well, that's utter shite. That I actually lost my uh, bread roll for good. I think that's all the guitar does. A little shock attack. That's kind of lame. I expected a little bit more variety. Okay, I'll say we can use life up. There, that's better. There's another item over there. Okay, looks like we have to find another way to reach it. Okay, I think we know how. We gotta do it from this side. Okay, now I'm confused. Can't reach it from this side for some reason. Maybe I was at the right way the whole time and I just did not notice. So I can't go around this. Okay, apparently the gentle weeping guitar does have a normal attack. We just never ever seen it until now. How do you get through there? Oh, we were supposed to go this way! Oh my god, I feel like such an idiot. Squeak this week! Oi, Alfie! It's been donkeys, China! Wanted rabbit as us at a some more bees, is that it? Eh, that's Calvin! The old butt ain't using the bugs! But Monster Dicky! Oh, uh, okay, that gave me cheese for some reason. We've been waiting a bloody long time, Ari Lime, I'll pet with you at On Ye Toblerone. What? Eh? Is that you, Alfie? Where you been with that scene on the ticket bird? You didn't come by for New Year's or crack a night. So your grandma and I have been all jack? So what ya? You must be playing the dark barfin, eh? Here's some of that nut bread for ya. Boy, ain't you show my gem and running the more bah. If my brain can't talk. Some nice stuff was inside. You ate it right there. You felt something warm inside your heart. Aww. Okay, I'm guessing all of these will do the same thing for you, like recover all your HP and PP. So definitely take advantage of that. Alright, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna deposit this. Yeah, deposit it all. Better be safe than sorry. And now, let us save our game. Sorry, I hit the mic there. Doesn't give me much room to scratch my left cheek or anything. Sun tells me something bad's gonna happen, that's why we need this. Looks like we gonna have to fight it out. With two of these, this could be fun. Let's see how you like this. Well, that sure showed me! <laughs> A 16-beat attack? Oh, it changed the mood! In other words, the drum's rhythm is a little bit different. So it's slightly faster. That's pretty interesting. Oh, 
Oh yeah, coffee's still good. A magic gelatin? Oh, we're out of room. Well, nut bread is a pretty terrible healing item at this point in the game, so here. So magic gelatin will really help us out. Okay. Let's try a sneak attack. As you can plainly see, I am a wooden base. I'm still in my prime. But ever since the base below showed up, I've been left to run this moldy smelling attic. That's not my problem. I'm filled with so much frustration. I'm gonna turn this frustration into violence and take my stress out on you guys. You're gonna be bawling your eyes out. Okay. The jealous base wants to fight all of us. Well, with its allies. Alright, let's use like PKLPs and Lola, you're gonna start using your items. Let's try the sprinting bomb. Didn't do much against the base though. Okay, looks like we're gonna be getting rid of those minions. A jam session attack? Okay. So that was just like a combo move. Would the thunder bomb work better against the base? No, it's worse. Okay, now it's in a frenzy. Its offense increased. Okay. I can say I, we might need to raise our defense. <laughs> 69. Ouch! Here, I'll boost your defense too. And you eat the nut bread. Luckily, it was only a solo one. I might need to heal up a little bit more. I don't know if cola is good for dogs, but drink it anyway, because apparently it is in this game. Alright, let's see how you like this. I say we should have this boss on the ropes now. Now eat some fries. Lola's just eating a lot of things that are unhealthy for dogs in this battle. Alright, let's boost my HP back up. Hypnosis? Oh no. Lola, do you have anything that can wake him up? That's for confusion. Damage is a mechanical enemy as well. A base is not a mechanical enemy. Alright, try the sprinting bomb. Okay, it is a physical attack, so it will wake me up. That's good. Ha! Lola got the finishing blow! We got 1,352 experience. There's a hole there. It looks like you can jump down from it. Try jumping down? Well, there's nothing else for us to do, yeah. Meanwhile... Oh, hi. What took you so long? Well, I kind of did get lost here. Anyways... I just finished explaining everything to the band members. Oh, she just says the same thing. Oh man, what to do? Phew. We're discussing things right now. Oh, okay. I will just save right here. Because I don't want to fight that... Well, I couldn't fight that boss again, but I... Don't want to, like... Back there. Don Dagasa! So you're the one trying to run off with Lucky? Yeah. Don Dagasa! Who are you? 
He's the one I was talking about just now, Tiju. You two know each other. Tiju? It's true that I don't even remember my real name. But I've lived my life as Lucky for years now. Oh, it's only been three. Okay. Alright, Lucky. I hate to ask, but could you tell him everything you remember too? Yeah, alright. I can definitely tell that something very important is taking place here. I absolutely had no memory whatsoever from before I came to Club Titty Boo. I had no idea who I was, where I came from, or where I was going. But for some reason, I was clutching a strange egg with great care. I didn't know where I was going, yet I continued to walk desperately. All I knew was that the egg was really important for some reason. Well, eggs have a lot of good cholesterol after all. I mean, I knew I had absolutely had to keep it safe. So I looked for a place to hide it. And then, after walking and walking, um, shouldn't we be having this as a private matter? Why is the band listening in on this? I buried the egg inside a big dirt clod in a valley where I knew no one would ever find it. I still know where it is. I haven't forgotten. You go up a cliff near a giant waterfall and... Oh, there's that tower we saw much earlier. Unknown Valley! That's it, Tiju! The egg we all work so hard to protect is there! Let's go there right now! But, am I really Tiju? If I am this Tiju person, that means I'll have to leave the band, right? Tiju or Lucky. One of them will cease to exist after today, right? If it turns out I'm Tiju, what happens to the DCMC? But if I continue to live as Lucky, then what was that egg thing all about? What should I do? I just can't decide. Wait, the bird! Use the bird! Of course he can't. All you can do is ask Destiny. Yeah. If Destiny decides it, I'll say goodbye to you with a smile on my face. Destiny, huh? Yeah, let's ask Destiny. We have a way. The same thing we've always done whenever we weren't sure what to do. Stone sheet clippers, huh? That's like rock, paper, scissors. Yep. This bonga fellow will play stone sheet clippers with us. If he beats all five of us in a row, you'll go. But if he loses even once, you'll stay in the DCMC and keep on playing the bass. How's that sound? Five in row, huh? I'm cool with that. You there. You're okay with that, right? Okay, well, we're ready to begin when you are. You can start with any one of us. Let's start with you. Whenever me, Magic, and Bakio play Stone Sheet Clippers, we always end in a tie. Let me be the last one to go. After all, I am the band leader. Okay. Always ends in a tie. I always wind up tying whenever I play Stone Sheet Clippers with Shimmy. Alright, let's do this thing. Um... You tie with Shimmy. For the most part, everyone always does a specific first move when playing this game. That explains why Bakio loses to Magic. You ready to go? You always tie to Shimmy, but you always lose. You always lose to him. Bakio always loses to him. Okay. Shimmy almost always starts with Stone. It's up to you to believe that or not, though. Okay, so Shimmy usually starts with Stone, so that means I would have to use Sheet against him. All right. Here goes. Stone sheet clippers. There 
go. I lose! I lose a pizzazz! Alright, so... Uh, you always tie with... Sh you always tie with him. So that means he also uses stone. Yeah! I won't complain. You win! Okay, and uh, Bakio always loses to you. So that means he always picks Shears. That means I have to pick Stone. There we go! I seem to recall that whenever me, Magic, and our band leader play Stone Sheep Clippers... Okay, Magic is the one that usually picks the, um... What was it that he picks again? Or was it the paper? On oh, the sheets, yeah. He always picks the paper. Does he always pick the sheets? No, he picks the stone. So I have to pick the sheets. Is it best if I win? No, I leave that up to destiny. Achoo! Sorry, do over. Stone sheet clippers. Looks like I lose. Alright, well, if there's always a tie, that means I had to pick a stone. I'm gonna trust in destiny. If it's my destiny to go, then I'm sure he'll win. And if it's not my destiny, he'll lose and I'll stay here. It's as simple as that. Okay then. Banga. Do clippers. I'm going to do sheet. Tondagasa! Alright, here we go. Don't cheat clippers! Huh? Oh, I'm so happy! Not! Give it down, will ya? Okay, so he did pick sheet the whole time. Save your guys hooting and hollering for the stage! Looks like they haven't noticed you guys. I forgot what we did, so let's do a do-over. Stone Sheet Clippers! Ready, set, go! Um, what happened? I see. So this is Destiny. I guess Lucky, Lucky probably is this Taju guy after all. Go. Don't worry about anything else at all. I think the Jew hit the egg in Unknown Valley. Which means I have no reason to stay here anymore either. Alright, time to get out of these girl clothes. Thanks for everything, guys. Take care now. Out of my way, damn it! Lucky. No, to Jew, I guess. You were the greatest bass player ever. I'm gonna miss you, man. Aww. I hope we meet again someday. I'm sure we will. I feel bad for these guys because we did destroy their base that they left in the attic. Don't go forgetting the time you spent with us now, you dig? I'm sure he won't forget. Lucky. Nah, he won't forget. I still don't remember anything, but I'll come with you guys anyway. Okay, let's go. Alright, Tiju is back with us. Alright, hopefully his level scaled with us. He probably didn't. Oh, is that 20? That's not terrible at all. Does he need new equipment? I'm pretty sure he's fine. 
Yeah, you should be fine. Alright, we definitely need to save because a lot just happened. Now we're a party of three. And then once we get Grotus, it'll be a party of four. So, I'll stop the video right here, and in the next part, we're gonna head on out. See ya, everyone!